there, so when he got there. <laughs> I, 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 um, I think we're all blessed to have the governor here, and I just, David, um, you know, my life right now is focused on prison ministry, and it will be, um, you know, to the end of my days, and I've had numerous conversations with the governor on treatment, on my frustration with the fact that 96% of the people that are released from, that are in behind bars are going to be released, but yet we don't give them the tools necessary. And this governor, in two state, state of the state addresses previously, talked about the need for treatment with the support of the legislature, and I've just got the greatest personal respect and admiration uh, for a governor, you know, it, I'll just say to David that there probably aren't many registered Republicans in this room. Um, and the governor is here. Um, the governor is here because he's committed to treatment. And what's special is, um, it's a heartfelt commitment. And I remember one time the governor sharing with me a discussion about a particular issue. And it's something that stuck with me.